Team Rubicon is doing preventative work to help protect homes and the endangered species that live here. While it's not somebody's worst day, we're preventing their worst day by doing this work. About 40 volunteers with Team Rubicon grabbed their saws and went to work in the Twin Springs Preserve in Williamson County. You know, we're free and, and everybody's out here because we love to do it. This will save the community upwards of $100,000. They're creating a shaded fuel break. It's about the, the taking out trees that either are dead or that the department Department of Parks and Recs have deemed that we're taking out. They're either too, too wild, too big, too small. To go from this to this, about 75,000 square feet clear. We want to separate trees from houses and we want a break in there. We want it shaded, which means we still have some top cover for all the wonderful critters that live in, in the areas and, and for people to be able to walk and enjoy the shade. Uh, but we also want a separation of the fuel, taking the fuel away from being near houses. So if a fire did start, it would stop at the fuel break. In 2022, Texas A&M Forest Service and local fire departments responded to almost 12,000 wildfires that burned more than 640,000 acres across the state including hundreds of acres burned in Williamson County. Anything we can do to, to help the, the local first responders be able to get in and fight these fires by creating these breaks, giving them some time, giving them some space, it, it, it's a great thing. This shaded fuel break is part of the Williamson County Wildfire Protection Plan and the Habitat Conservation Plan to protect the endangered species like golden-cheeked warblers and Georgetown salamanders. Environmentally, uh, this is the optimal time of year to help the environment. The, the warbler's breeding season, as I understand it, begins on the 1st of March. So that gives us a, about a three-month window to be able to affect this. Reporting in Williamson County, Meredith Aldis, Fox 7 Austin News.